Shut up, you don't think Ryan is famous? Cousin Ryan. You got it right. Hey, what's up, YouTube friends and family? It's your cousin Ryan, and I'm here doing a serial review by myself again today. Joel is off to the UK once more. Um, it will be a little while before we get him back. And I just, I know we kicked off the holiday cereals last week with him, with the gingerbread life, but the cereal that we're, I'm about to try this morning, just, man, I wish Joel was here for this one. It is Elf on the Shelf cereal. Um, it's weird, that's goofy, Elf on the Shelf cereal. I mean, of course, Elf on the Shelf is such a cash grab now. Why wouldn't they have cereal? So it is sugar cookie cereal with marshmallows. You know me and marshmallows. I love marshmallows. Uh, Elf on the Shelf, a Christmas tradition. So let's see if this cereal is worth calling it a tradition, a Christmas tradition. Now already I'm not seeing very many marshmallows in here. Um, as you can see, let's get that in there right there. It's these little red and green stars and then tiny, tiny, tiny little marshmallow pieces. I mean, I don't even know if you can see those. So, it smells pretty good. It smells really good. Let's see how it tastes. I'm gonna grab a dry piece. That tastes pretty good. That almost tastes like a marshmallow itself with a crunch. I'm seeing one marshmallow in here out of this whole thing. That one I showed you looks like it's it. So we'll get it in the first bite. It tastes pretty sugar cookery. Cookery? Cookie-ery? It's pretty good. I think I like this. I think this one's a keeper as far as holiday cereals go. I like it a lot. And I think of all the things out there that claim to be sugar cookie flavored this time of year, this, uh, this cereal gets pretty dang close. The only thing I think that throws me off is the texture. Oh, there's another marshmallow. But yeah, I like it. I don't need more than one box. It's not like I'm gonna go out and get a box and eat it in a week. One box for the entire Christmas season is good enough for me. Um, I like it. If Elf on a Shelf is a tradition in your family, um, which it's kind of not for ours, to be honest with you. This is before my, or excuse me, after my childhood and slightly after Riders. Never did Elf on a Shelf with him, so. Anyway, but if it is a part of your family tradition, this is a cool little uh, addition you can have there during the holiday season. Um, I really like this. I'm gonna keep this box for myself. Um, like I said though, I don't think I need more than one box, but I'm glad I got it, I'm glad I tried it, or I tried it, excuse me. And um, again, if it's out next year, I'll probably buy another box. So anyway, Thanks for hanging out with me this morning. I don't know, it's pouring rain. I don't know if you can hear it out there, but if the camera's picking it up or not, but it is absolutely pouring this morning. Um, with that being said, we will have some more cereals to review. Uh, holiday themed cereals coming up in the next, uh, I don't know, maybe we'll do one tomorrow. I don't know. I've kind of been thinking of getting my dad in on this, bring him in and uh, have him try a couple of these cereals while Joel is gone. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe we'll have one tomorrow. Maybe we'll have one next week, but we've definitely got more to try out between now and Christmas. So uh, until next time, stay tuned and thanks for hanging out. You know, sir, it's Cousin Ryan and the Hollywood Bully Bar. You know, sir, he's bigger than any superstar. All of us spit you some, some real to a bar. Some of them sweeter than any chocolate bar. Boom! Okay. <laughs>